Hello, I'm Katie Bryan, eBlex Better Returns Program Project Manager. Today we're going to look at how to conduct a RAM MOT and why it's important. You need to conduct a RAM MOT at least 10 weeks before tupping, so there's time to put procedures in place if there's a problem. You need to look at the five T's, which are toes, teeth, tone, testicles and treatments. So first of all, you need to have a look at the ram's teeth, check there's not any gaps, check they're not undershot, overshot, because you need to make sure he can eat well throughout the tupping season and the rest of the year. Secondly, you need to look at his tone and check his body condition score. They need to be at three and a half to four body condition score at the start of the tupping period because they can lose up to 15% body weight during tupping. You need to watch his locomotion and check he can walk well on all four feet. Obviously you need the rams to be able to walk around the field and get to all of the ewes so you don't need a lame ram and you need to make sure he hasn't got any foot rot or any other conditions. You also need to make sure for older rams that they're not arthritic so that they can manage to mount the ewes correctly to serve them. For treatments you need to make sure the rams treatments are all up to date. Make sure they're sheared well in advance of the hot summers because you don't want them to get too hot and sweaty before the breeding season and any vaccinations also need to be up to date and any treatments for ectoparasites. Finally you need to look at their testicles and check that they're okay. You can have a look at them standing up or alternatively tip them over and you want to have a feel of the testicles and make sure they're of nice even size and a nice firm um, consistency and just check the epididymis at the bottom to check they're nice and firm as well. As regards testicle size, um, big, is, big is beautiful really, um, so the bigger the testicles the more semen they're going to produce, so you don't want a ram to have too small testicles, you want him to have um, big testicles, so in this area for a mature ram you want them to be over 36 centimetres, which this ram easily is, is about 38 centimetres. Um, and then you just need to check around the prep use and check that there's no uh, lesions around and check that he's able to extrude the penis okay, which he's um, doing there for us now. Mm -hmm.